Hello all, welcome to this session. In this session, I am going to answer one of the Selenium interview questions. That is, what is the purpose of get options method or command in Selenium WebDriver? Let me answer. Using this get options command in Selenium WebDriver, we can retrieve all the options in the dropdown field or multi selection box field. Let me show you. I'll open this browser and take you to the sample application that is omai.blogspot.com. On this application page, there's a drop down field here. Okay. If I select this drop down field, how many options are there total? Older newsletter, doc1, doc2, doc3, doc4. Total five options are there. If you want to retrieve all these five options from this drop down field, then the command we have to use in Selenium WebDriver is get options command. Similarly, there's a multi selection box field containing four options. We want to retrieve all these four options from this multi selection box field. Again, we have to use the same command known as get options command. Let me practically demonstrate this for you. For that, I'll switch to this Eclipse ID where we have the sample automation code already written for opening the Chrome browser, maximizing the browser window. And here we need to open the application URL. I'll give this application URL where we have this drop down or multi selection box field. Copy this URL and paste it here. Once we are on the uh, application page like this, okay? Then let's talk about this drop down field. Let's retrieve all these options from the drop down field. For that, right click on the drop down field and inspect this drop down field. So, this is HTML code of the drop down field. It has an ID. Copy this ID and uh, we can use that ID to locate the drop down field driver dot find element by dot ID. Use that ID locator of the drop down field, put a semicolon. Let's create the web element out of it. Drop down field is equal to. Okay, for the most create local variable. That's it. Web element got created for the drop down field. Now create an object for the select class in Selenium. Select select is equal new select. Now import this select class from Selenium library and uh, pass this uh, web element drop down field web element in the select constructor here. Okay, done. Now use object reference select this object reference use it here and uh, say dot get options this is a command right get options is a command so select dot get options whatever the options that are there in the drop down field okay there are total five options in the drop down field will be retrieved and will be returned in the form of list of web element so i'll say options options is equal to or the most and say create local variable list of web element okay all the set of options, all the, uh, you know, all the options that are there in the drop down field will be retrieved in the form of web elements here, list of web elements here. Now write for, for each loop, where each and every option is a web element, option colon options, this options, option colon options will iterate for each and every option in the drop down field, which got, which got retrieved with the help of get options command. Now here I'll write down, System dot out dot print here and option dot get text. Okay. So every option is having some text between the tags. You see this option in this drop down field. This is the first option which is there between the tags of tags. Okay. The second option this is the text between the tags. Third option I'm retrieving all the text between the tags of this individual options of this drop down field with the help of this uh, option dot get text. Now after that, I'll simply say driver dot switch. Okay, in the output console, all the options should be retrieved and printed. Okay, all the options in the drop down field should be retrieved. Total five options should be retrieved and printed in the output console after running this code. Just observe here all the options in the drop down field, like older newsletter, doc1, doc2, doc3, doc4 got retrieved and printed in the output console. Similarly, we can also retrieve all the options from this multi selection box field. Select this multi selection box field and inspect. It has an ID. Copy this ID locator of the multi selection box field and uh, here change it from the drop down field to multi selection box field. Here, instead of drop down, it is multi selection box field. Okay. Copy this multi selection box field and paste in place of this uh, select constructor thing. Okay. And now, if you say select or get options, all the options in this multi selection box field will be retrieved and will be printed. What are the Options we have Volvo, Swift, Hyundai, and Audi should be retrieved and printed. The same logic will apply. Option dot get text. So right click run as Java application. All the four options in the multi selection box will be retrieved and printed in the 
output console now. Let's switch. See all the four options for uh, Volvo Swift, Swift and already got retrieved and printed in the output console. So hope guys you understood how the what is the purpose or how to use the get get options uh, command in Selenium web driver. Okay, this is the purpose to retrieve all the options from the drop down or multi selection box. We have to use get options. Okay, so that's all for this session. Thank you. Bye bye.